exploring is in my nature. As a human being that evolved to walk around the planet surviving, being sat at a desk doesn't feel good. I don't want to live in a full-time, non-participating life and feel separated from my own senses. Hunting is an existential experience that pushes my boundaries and challenges me. It tests my ability to be alive, away from the comfort of my home. We've become experts at controlling the space around us. Life has become safer, more convenient, but for me, unfulfilling. Hunting is my reaction to an ever sedentary society. Being privileged enough to draw a tag to harvest an alpine ibex in the Swiss Alps really is a once in a lifetime humbling opportunity. A lot of personal investment goes into a trip like this. Failure and disappointment are an ever-present reality. The treacherous terrain, unpredictable weather and wily nature of the Ibex all work against me. This iconic species was driven close to extinction in the mid-20th century. Through a process of conservation, partly driven by hunting, around 15,000 head now reside in Switzerland alone. Every year, 200 are hunted in the region, just 30 of which mature trophy males. The proceeds go to fund wildlife ranges and conservation that protects all wildlife in the Swiss mountains, not just these ibex. These regal beasts defy gravity as they effortlessly navigate craggy outreaches to evade an inexperienced or careless hunter. <laughs> I'm often asked, why would you want to hunt these magnificent creatures? Hunting is not looked on favourably by the world's eyes at the moment. But the ongoing debate in the media has only reassured my passion and belief that ethical, fair chase hunting is a vital tool for managing wildlife. The incredible male that I'd hunted was 12 years old and well past prime breeding age. He'd already passed on all of his good genes. Nothing ever dies of old age in the wild. Animals grow tired, can't move as quickly, lose teeth, get injured, can't get a whatever grass they need, and in the end, even predators become prey. It's a tooth and claw world. Nature is brutal and indiscriminate, unsentimental and cruel. And we used to be part of that process too. It may be a bitter pill for some to swallow, but trophy hunting and conservation go hand in glove, and I'm proud to be part of that story. It goes without saying that nothing was wasted from the carcass. I want a sense of purpose around my movements on this planet, together with a biologically appropriate lifestyle. Hunting and harvesting my own meat gives me a great sense of being, and I wouldn't change a thing.